Hey guys, welcome to SSUV Tech. So see this side, and this is part one of DAX. So in this video series, you will see a lot of DAX functions that will be very helpful while you are going to create the visualization inside the Power BI. So first of all, we need to understand what is the DAX. So DAX is called as Data Analysis Expressions. So it is a library of functions and operators that can be combined to build formulas and expressions in Power BI Desktop, Azure Analysis Services, SQL Server Analysis Services, and Power Pivot in Excel Data Models. So we need to understand DAX is a collection of functions that can be used according to our requirement. Next is types of DAX functions. So we have a lot of types. For example, we have text functions, we have date type functions, we have time intelligence functions, and many more. So we'll see one by one in our upcoming videos in details. As of now, we need to understand what is the text functions. So with these type of functions, you can return a part of a string, search for text within a string or concatenate string values. Additional functions are for controlling the formats for dates, times and numbers. So this is for text functions. Next we have date and time functions. So these functions in DAX are very similar to date and time functions in Microsoft Excel. However, DAX functions are based on the date time data types used by Microsoft SQL Server. Next is time intelligence functions. So these functions help you to create calculations that use built-in knowledge about calendars and dates by using time and date range in combination and aggregation or calculation you can build meaningful comparison across comparable time periods for sales inventory and many more so we'll see in upcoming videos next is mathematical and trigonometrical functions so mathematical functions in the dax are very similar to Excel's mathematical and trigonometrical functions. So there are some differences in the numeric data types used by DAX functions. So we'll see in the detail in the upcoming videos. Next is the filter function. So these functions help you return specific data types, looks up values in the related tables and filter by related values. Lookup functions work by using tables and relationships between them. Filtering functions let you manipulate data content to create dynamic calculations. Next is information functions. So these functions look at a table or column provided as a argument to another function and tells you whether the function matches the expected type. So for example, here we have a function that is is error. So it will return two values either true or false if containing value having an error so that will be true otherwise false next is logical function so in the logical function these functions return information about values in an expression for example the true function let you know whether an expression that you are evaluating returning a true value or next is we have parent and child functions so these data analysis expressions Functions help user manage data that is presented as parent-child hierarchy in the data model. Next is statical functions. So basically these functions perform aggregations in addition to create sum and average or finding minimum and maximum values. In the DAX you can also filter a column before aggregating or creating it. Next is we have other functions. So basically these functions perform unique actions that cannot be defined by any of the categories most other functions belongs to. All these functions, so this is very important while we are going to create the measures inside the Power BI desktop and in our upcoming videos we will discuss about these functions in detail and we will see the functions and how we can use those functions and how we can create the measures by using that functions so guys thank you so much for watching this video if you like this video please subscribe our channel to get many more videos don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification of our newly uploaded videos thank you so much see you in the next video